What's up everybody, it's Erskine the Prophet here to do another video And today I'm going to be doing Gamora Season 4, Episode 12, the finale review And uh, the main theme I'm going to tackle in this video Is why did Jenna kill Patricia? Now, there, there were a, you know, a few things You know, in this finale, a few main themes Well, actually two main themes in a way The first was... Uh, them trying to kill Enzo and the second was what was going on with Patricia and Jenna breaking her out of jail now I'm gonna tell y'all you know I'm, I'm shocked and surprised that Enzo made it out of this episode only because of the way they were stacking up bodies this season they they man they killed a lot of cats this season you know a lot of my favorite cats got killed this season so I was really expecting Enzo to get it but I'm glad he didn't. I'm glad he survived. And, uh, you know, I'm glad he made it to season five. They will be, they are working on a season five as far as I know. And I think, uh, excuse me, the fifth season is the final season. But there definitely will be a fifth season. Now, I'm going to tell y'all, let me just sidetrack just a little bit. Because I'm going to tell y'all, season four was not the same without Jero. I really hope some way, somehow, they bring Jero back for season five because the show is just not the same without him. I know they, they got a thing on Gamora for killing off characters. You know, they kill off characters more than game. They, they're worse than Game of Thrones. I've never seen a show kill off so many important characters like this one does. I mean, they've killed, like, if you look at season one, the only one that's left is Jenna from season one. He, everybody else is dead now. Uh, which I'm going to get to in a minute because, uh, you know, we, we had three more bodies. No, actually way more than three. Um, shit, I don't even know how many bodies we added to the count this uh, with this episode. But anyway, Enzo was able to get away because one of his friends came and warned him that they knew where he was and they was coming for him. But uh, Enzo's girl, uh, Maria, was not able to get away. And... Uh, you know, when Enzo got to it, she was already dead, you know, which is sad for me. That's one thing about this show, man. This show does not shy away from killing women. God damn. I thought these cats was the ones who invented the code, you know, no women, no children. But God damn, man, they, they got no problem smoking women on this show for sure. <laughs> so if you if you the type who don't want to see that type of thing, that this show might not be for you. Because uh, a lot of the women, I like the gun, you know, like, God damn. <laughs> And I'm not, man, I'm talking straight up executed too, like assassinated. But um, anyway, yeah, Maria was uh, another one. Then, uh, you know, we saw Jenna, I think, man, him, he had some people shoot up a whole bunch of people in cars. It looked like <clears throat> that was Jenna's family. So I'm assuming he took out a whole lot of his family, which um, in a way, you know, I got, it's justified because, um, you know, Jenna lost two shipments this season, two shipments of uh, heroin. You know, they set Patrice up twice. The, the police got Patrice twice and took two of her shipments. Those shipments come from Jenna. So, you know, I don't know if that's why he got them or, you know, because of them giving Patrice such a hard time. Because he the one that put Patrice in place to be the boss. Now, I'm about to get to Patrice because I'm, I'm, man, I'm, I'm fucked up. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Okay. We see Jenna boys break Patrice out of jail. Actually, before they even broke out, her husband came to meet her at that hotel or wherever they were staying. So they actually broke both of them out. You know, um, because he was with her. You know, uh, they break them out. We see them in the car together. And then they drive up to a spot where Jenna's at. And uh, there's a plane there, you know, so the uh, Michelo, you know, asked Jenna, what's up? Is that plane for them? Jenna says, yeah. And he's like, where is it going? And he's like, far away. That would be the best thing for all of us. And then he asked to speak to Patrice alone. So the husband goes and gets on the plane. And then uh, Jenna starts talking to Patrice, you know, saying that he's took care of things. And the next person he's going to take care of is that inspector. And then he asked Patrice that um what did she say to the inspector 
and she and he asked her did the inspector ask her about him and Patrice said no I honestly think that was the reason why Jenna killed her I'm not sure if he was going to kill her anyway but once she told him no that the inspector didn't ask about uh, Jenna Jenna knew she was lying and she was lying and why she lied about that I have no idea I don't understand why she would even lie about that when Jenna had already broken her out of jail. Why would you lie about that? Honestly, I don't even understand why Patrice talked to that fucking inspector in the first place. Why? I mean, okay. You know, before I get to Patrice, let me address Jenna. Jenna shot and killed Patrice. You know, Jenna, I mean, Patrice was like, is this it, Jenna? And Pat Jenna was like, yeah, this is it. And then he blasted her twice. And then he blasted her again when she was lying on the ground. Now, I'm going to say this. I don't really like the way they kill women on this show. I, 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 I don't really like it. I love this show. But I wish they didn't kill the women so frequently. Now, Jenna killing Patricia really puts me... I really didn't like that because of the fact that Jenna... Uh, oh, I demand... Okay, just looking at the time on the video... Je P Patricia saved Jenna and his wife's life. Number one. Remember when that uh, sniper was about to pop both of them on the beach? Patricia shot and killed the sniper before he shot and killed Jenna and his wife. That's reason number one why I have a problem with this. Patricia saved their lives. Number two reason is that she was a woman. <laughs> number two. I got a problem with these dudes shooting and killing women. I just don't like it. I, I don't know. Man, I'm, a, I'm gangster with it, but that just really kind of, I don't know, it's, it kind of rubs me the wrong way a little bit. Number three, she was fucking pregnant. So not only did he kill a woman, he killed the child. The whole rule of no women, no children, I guess goes out the window for these dudes. But then Italy, the you know, that's where gangster, the real gangsters come from. You know, so I don't know how, I, it, it just bothers me that he shot and killed a pregnant woman that he put in place in the first place. It just seemed like there had to be a better way. And before she, he even shot and killed Patricia, he made sure that she heard her husband get shot because, you know, her husband got shot too. He was on the plane. You know, they didn't show it or anything, but she heard him get shot. And then that's when she, then, you know, Jenna pulled the gun out and she knew she was about to get it, and she got it too. So not only did he kill her and her unborn kid, he made sure that she knew her husband got killed first. So that was just like some evil shit to me, man. I, I, I don't know, that was like, I know business is business. It just seems like there had to be some other way because now Patrice was bro broken out of jail. Now, let me go back to Patrice, Patricia. And even though I hated to see her get shot like that, in a way, she did deserve it. Because, yo, she wasn't in jail before a couple fucking days. She broke down that fast. Now, she's a boss. She's a boss. A boss. And she breaks down that fast. Remember uh, Jenna's father? That dude was in jail for years. Years. She broke down after a couple days. So, and then... She asked to speak to that inspector, which kind of, you know, like blew me. Like, come on, man, why is she asking to speak to the inspector? And then, now, in the show, they didn't really show a lot of the conversations that she had, you know, with the inspector. They would show them talking, and then they would go away from it. But they did, we did see the inspector show her a picture, and um, she looked at the picture, and then they switched scenes. So he definitely showed her a picture of Jenna, and then the next thing you know, she got this deal. So they, it kind of implied that she said something about Jenna to him. Now, for that reason, she really should have been killed. She should have, but I still had a problem. Maybe I would it would have been better with me if um, Jenna would have had somebody else do it, or maybe if they would have did her like they did Alberto, you know, where you know where his brakes just went out. You know, do something like that, maybe. But the executor, that just left a bad taste in my mouth. Even though Patricia went out like a straight fucking sucker, <laughs> for real. You know what I'm saying? She didn't go out like a boss at all. 
And, and it kind of shows when Jenna said he made mistakes, one of his mistakes was making her a boss. Because, um, and even I will say to her, his family who didn't like her, who sabotaged her, they kind of was right, because she just wasn't a boss. She just, like I said, anybody who breaks down after a couple of days in jail, a couple of days, and she already folding? I mean, come on, man, that just was, that just was not a good look for her. So I, I, I get it. She should have got it. She should have got killed. But just the way it went down just felt so damn evil. You know, and I just wish, and, and not to mention, honestly, my three favorite characters on the show have always been Jero, Jenna, and then when Patricia came on, she was, I just liked her from the jump. So to see one of my, two of my, because Jero got it last season and Patricia got it this season, so two of my favorite characters are gone. You know, oh, and uh, Jenna's father, he was a beast too. I liked him a lot too. I, I was sad to see him get it. But um, but Jero for sure, if they gotta bring, some, they definitely can't bring Patricia back. But if they can bring Jero back for season five, that would be fucking awesome, awesome. But yeah, y'all, that's, that's just my opinion on, on the, the finale. You know, I'm glad Enzo got away. And I'm sorry Patricia didn't. I would love to know, you know, if y'all have watched it, you know, um, I would love to know y'all thoughts, how y'all feel about it, what y'all think. The, do y'all think Patricia should have got killed? You know, um, hey, just to let y'all know, for those of y'all who don't watch the show and may be watching this video, the music on this show is badass. This show has some of the best music I've heard. And like I'm gonna say, the other shows that I think have really good music was Spartacus. Spartacus had really good music. Um, Game of Thrones had really good music. Um, and this show, like, I got to put this show up there with those two. The way they use and implement music. I mean, the way they show their previews with the music. I mean, it's just, they do a really, really good job with the music. And what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to include the um, their theme song at the end of this video. Um, I, I never tried to edit a song, so if it don't work, what I'll do is I'll just make another video for their theme song. Um, but yeah, y'all really got to hear this theme song. This is one of the best theme songs I've ever heard in the show. And uh, yeah, I don't own the rights to it. You know, let me say that. I'm just uh, putting it up here to help uh, promote uh, the show Gamora because I like it a lot. I love the show. I just hope next season, uh, when season five come back, they, they somehow bring Jero back. The show needs that dude. If it don't need nobody else, it definitely needs Jenna and Jero. Um, but anyway, and Enzo, and uh, I thought Enzo and Patricia were bulletproof too, but I guess not. But anyway, y'all, like I said, I'd love to hear y'all thoughts about the finale. Um, you know, leave some comments. Uh, tell me, like I said, tell me what y'all thought about Enzo getting away. Did y'all think he was going to get away? And what y'all think about Patricia getting killed? Uh, that, that really just broke my heart. I ain't going to lie. Anyway, y'all, please like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Please turn on the notifications. I love y'all. Anybody who watches the video, I love you. Everybody, please stay safe, stay healthy, stay strong. Peace.